Mirrors. I wonder how many of my live streams end up just starting out like sounding really boring because I got to check a few things before I know that everything's working good. So it would be kind of awkward to be forced enthusiasm. You know what I mean? Ah, but finally we got some time to play dragon and home. Oh my God. So I, I know that in my last video, I kind of promised you guys uh, that I had a recorded episode talking about getting a mount. I decided to scrap it. I thought, screw it. I'll just give you guys a quick rundown of how you end up getting mounts in the game. Uh, because it's kind of annoying. And then we'll just adventure and play together and stuff, right? Because, uh, hey, um, what's the friend menu? P. Hey, there we go. So you guys can always add me up. Uh, and I'm down to play together, man. Like, I'm really excited about this. Uh, no, it's not an Xbox, dude. This game literally just came out, uh, and it's on PC only as far as I know right now. Okay, <clears throat> so, basically, the way that you end up getting a mount, um, there's a lot of mechanics involved with it. You can see my mount kind of sucks. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, it's random. The weird thing, too, is it doesn't seem to matter what the creature looks like out in the wild because I tamed a brown horse and then for some reason he just turned into whatever the heck this shadow steed is with a black butt. Um, so basically out of either harvesting like we're going to do right here just because I got my farm going a little bit. I guess you guys haven't really seen my base. I haven't done that much, frankly speaking. Um, but basically you can either do harvesting like that or you can go out into the open world and gather feathers or feathers carrots sorry uh, and you literally will use it to convert it into these feeds carrot just is pretty much the easiest one that you can end up crafting because as you can see the wheat takes a long time uh, but basically you gotta gather like 50 carrots worth out in the open world that's the safest bet uh, thanks Thij for giving me the advice on that and then all you got to do is equip the steed feed uh, to your hot bar while you're out in the open world. And then you just go to the animal that it says, like this one says horses or wild boars. Careful, you don't die by a wild boar. But you can feed the animal until it gets a smiley face, which could be immediately or take a long time. And then once it says that it's happy, uh, you can throw the, pl uh, the plain collar on it. And there you go. You ended up taming him out. Uh, I can't craft more of these yet because I don't have my tannery. But hopefully we'll be able to get at least some progress with that. And then otherwise you can always uh, summon your mount at any point. Uh, and then you can hop on them. They actually have their own inventory, which is weird. Mine legit sucks. Like this is barely faster than walking. So I was super duper let down. Hi, Creighton. I didn't know you guys could come into my house. That's kind of creepy. <laughs> but yeah, so, uh, I mean, mounts get the job done, right? I, most of all, I got to get like a better mount. So I hope you guys can't steal my stuff. Like, geez, how does that work? So otherwise, all I've been doing was uh, I, I basically just log in. Uh, start crafting a bunch of crap and then I log out because that's basically this game right now <laughs> Like it's it's such a slow freaking process, dude and Does it not let you go in my personal chest critter good. I hope it doesn't Grab those out We'll get everything ready before we end up going um out into the world and fighting some stuff so you can see we're doing pretty darn good on my copper so i haven't been gathering that much finally doing good on my cloth uh but my flax thread is really really low right now maybe critter can access my home because he's friended me i mean you guys basically sushi man bottom middle of the screen is my username um we also so here's the thing i i forget what i had recorded in the last episode okay so i'm just gonna go through this with you guys um, so I do have the copper staff. I don't have this because once again, we need the tannery in order to craft the book. Uh, not that I can use it anyway, cause I'm too low level. And then I actually have all of the mages clothes right now. 
Uh, it's just that I can't end up equipping all of it. So like the armor itself that completely changes the way our character looks is uh, nine bucks. So yeah. Uh, this game is available on Steam and it's called Dragon and Home, which I know is like a extremely forgettable title. Um, okay, what, what quests are we going to end up doing today? Private mail. So here's the thing. This quest seems like it's bugged or broken or something because... It wants you to send a message to your friend, but it literally costs a currency I don't have. <laughs> cool. <laughs> so, okay. Um, use the assembly table to repair stuff. I can't do that right now either. For whatever reason, it won't let me repair anything. Handyman, do more home quests to develop faster. To develop faster? Excuse me. All right, stupid. Let's see. Home quests. What do they want me to do? Oh, good lord. Do I grab all of these or something? Are these just time-gated? Oh, good lord. Okay. Go to the village and complete a villager request. Turn in the... Okay, so these must be like dailies or something. Or maybe I just do them over time. I don't know. Uh, this is actually the reward, I think, that we need to have in order to send mail to complete that quest. Because a big problem with this game is that you, frankly, cannot get levels from grinding. If you do, okay, good luck. Um, because otherwise, for the most part, you have to do it from quest grinding, and it's pretty brutal. Okay, um, ah, this idiot up there. Look at this. See, it's so much more packed now. It, I know this might not seem like many people to you guys, but when I was playing on this, it was dead. Because it was, you know, closed beta stuff. Hello, stupid. Odd smell. Okay, cool. I don't know if that was the quest that we actually needed to claim, but whatever. Oh, excuse me. Uh, Kenan's letter. Odd smell. Okay, what do they want me to do? Kill mudroot. Ooh, I don't think I can do that. Collect flower seeds, turn in flower seeds. I can't do either of those because those are uh, in a very weird place. Let's skip down the list a little bit. Oh, no. It wants me to do the mount taming. I already did some taming, but okay, game. Uh, so this I can't do, I'm pretty sure, because we need a tannery in order to craft a taming table, I think. So we'll skip that for now. Join a co-built home. Nah. Return home and craft a mixing table. Nah. Craft a water pot. Go to a water source. Water 10 crops. Ew! That's pretty gross. Collect flax. Turn in loom and flax threat. Oh, okay. That I can easily do, actually. Do we need five flax? Oh, they want me to turn in a loom? Yikes. And then three flax thread. Okay. That's kind of annoying, but whatever. Just do that. I still don't know how this housing thing works. I can invite you to the home, but my friends are glitched. I don't... That's okay, Thiege. We'll, we'll get there eventually. I just don't know uh, the deal with most of those things. Uh, so this doesn't have anything in it. Goodbye, Loom. Kind of really wanted that for myself, but whatever. So, the Loom. He only wanted three flax thread. Thank you very much. No. There we go. I still really, like... Uh, one thing that I'm not the biggest fan of is the UI. I really hope that they end up uh, fixing it a little bit. It's a little too wonky right now. How to get skill points. Uh, literally just leveling up and grinding, basically. Um, grinding quests. I should be clear about that because grinding mobs just barely gets you anything. Good lord, look at this champ. Jeez, dude. Sword and Shield's probably gonna end up being, like, way better than magic just because the, uh... I mean, the magic seems to be really powerful and we look really cool, don't we, Thiege? I need my robe, too. Meh. But... I think that greatsword would probably end up being the way that I'm going to go in this game. It's just going to take me a while to get there. Um, oh, it also, our main quest wants us to uh, hunt and turn in garden giants. I still don't know what those are. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, who is this uh, villager Mora? In terms of Mora. Uh -huh, again, shouldn't pun. Hello, lady um village rebuilding i didn't know that i had a bunch of quests that i could get from her wait oh flax whoops goodbye loom you will be missed game is so awkwardly quiet dude there we go 
Still gotta get the flax. Let's also grab the rest of her quests. Just because I didn't know that I needed to grab a bunch more quests off of these characters. Jordan Giant said, oh, are they the mushrooms? Okay, I've seen them before, but yeah, I never ended up actually uh, noticing their name was Garden Giants. So thank you for that one, Thish. Oh, whoops. Um, eh, eh, there we go. Apparently you can change like your profile picture too, which, okay. Wait, what? You want to trade with me? One sec, bruh. Let me see if I can grab some more quests. Furniture crafting. Uh-oh. I don't really want to be crafting anything, but cool. Yeah, hopefully you guys have been enjoying the game. I, I've been, you know, hopping in here and there so that I can end up grabbing uh, the odd quests, so on and so forth. And generally, I'm seeing the chat being a lot more lively and everything. So I'm I'm excited. All right, Thiege, what were you trying to do? Where's the Where's the trade? Oh. Okay, this game's a little bit janky, as you can tell. What are you doing? What's going on? Wait, when did I get a golden bread basket? Oh! Sure, thanks, bud. That's awesome. Um, That's probably a lot easier for you to craft than it is for me, isn't it? Uh, So we actually got seven feed right now, so we could try and tame a new creature. Heck yeah, dude um this is for horses and tricky odd birds i want it i want it bad because i want a better horse i hate my horse right now like seriously this thing sucks look at this look at this idiot i hate him but oh, i was t-posing on him for a sec and then look at this you know how there's stamina in this game and it's disgusting i mean it dashes pretty far but it is now out of stamina. <laughs> I kind of want to tame one of those birds. I don't want to... I, I hope I don't die from it, but... That is one of those ostriches, right? Like, that's that's the bird that they're talking about. Um, Odd birds. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's them. Also, for some reason, you can't, like, uh, side strafe or anything while you're on this thing. So I'm literally stuck going in a straight line. And it's kind of gross. Um... See if we can find any of them. Where are they? The mount, the fact that you can get mounts out of almost all of the creatures really reminds me of Cube World. Like, there's so many, like, random little gimmicks that this game has that I feel they took from inspiration from other games. Including, like, the combat and stuff feels very Sky Saga, doesn't it? Do I really want to tame one of these? He looks disgusting. All right, come here, you. You better, I swear to God, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Here you go, bud. Does that mean he's happy? Does he like me already? It'll say he's happy at some point, right? Don't kill me. Oh, God. And of course. And of course. Stupid game. <sighs> well, there goes all my steed feed now. So I gotta remember it's the guy on the right. This is taming, by the way, guys, just so you just so you know what it is. Okay, mine's the one that's on the right. I'm going to die. Can I eat this? That's a quest item. Oh, no. I need food, brah. Come on. Nope, stop. Give me apples, stupid tree. Yes. Yes. Num, 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 num. Give me a little bit. Okay. I should have been trying to tame a horse, dude. <laughs> Why am I trying to make this complicated? There you go, dum-dum. There you go, dum-dum. It looks happy. Grab him. Got him. You're mine now. Aha! Stupid creature. Lead away. No, I want this as my main mount. Does that... You already have a mount. Not anymore, I don't. <laughs> mount is already following you. Come on. <laughs> Hello? Oh. Hey, there we go. Oh, it's way worse. Considerably worse. This is awesome. <laughs> 
oh well, whatever. At least now I'm riding a bird. This is considerably worse. <laughs> Why am I getting the worst luck ever? The mounts in this game suck. Like, I need a good one. Can you trade mounts, these? You probably have like a whole bunch of garbage ones, right? <laughs> All right, well, anyways. Carry me to freedom, freedom bird. I need to get flax. Oh boy. I should have never gotten rid of my horse. Actually, it's fine. None of it really matters a lot for the early game stuff, so it's like, eh, whatever, brah. Uh, yeah, you, uh, it doesn't, like, require a crap ton of food. You pretty much just have to feed it until it says it's happy. I think seven is just kind of the average. Oh, God. Well, you know what? I gotta kill this thing anyway, right? Can I actually fight it? I never do damage to these guys. I think it's because they're elemental. I mean, maybe I can still beat him. Not when that happens. Okay. Huh. I got this. Now, if we're in a team and we all kill it together, that'll work, right? Oh, God. Stop! See, it wouldn't be so bad if I could, like, kite him around, but if I go too far, guess what happens? He just retreats and then gets all of his health back. Get away from me, you stupid extra. Nobody likes you. There you go. It's like a Dark Souls battle, right? It's so tricky. Not really. I'm able to actually beat him. I'm surprised. Die. Uh, excuse me? That was weird. Ew. One item, huh? <laughs> okay. Yeah, you might have just gotten lucky, Cory. Uh, that's what happened with me and my first mount, like the horse that we got rid of. May he rest in peace. Um, I was able to like tame him right away. I just kept feeding him, like overfeeding him. Actually, that was the three flax we already needed. But I can always use more because that's what being a mage is all about. Stone shovel. Oh, come on. I've gone through so many stone shovels, dude. It's ridiculous. Oops. Should automatically equip. Yeah, if any of you guys are online and you want to like chill together and stuff, just go to town because I'm going to be going in and out of town pretty often. Go, bird, go. Wow, look at him. He's so fast. At least they can run through water and go up one block spaces like horses do in Minecraft. Uh, I don't know how far we'll end up getting today or what we'll necessarily end up doing today. Like, we're kind of just going to be quest, quest grinding because I'm really, really hoping we'll get a skill point soon. Oh, excuse me. So that we can end up getting... Um, I should grab that flax, but I'm too lazy. I want to get a tannery really, really bad. You know? Yeah, that's the thing. That's why I kind of want to swap to a knight too, dude. Is because, yeah, I don't really like the aiming as much. And frankly speaking, it seems a lot easier to gear up as a warrior. Like, it's actually ridiculous. Oh, geez. I'm not used to the fact that the mount regens its stamina so quick. You can preserve stamina by jumping while sprinting. Okay, cool. It's working. It's working. No, it's not. I don't know. Huh. I mean, is it? I don't know. Personally, I just think they should get rid of the stamina system. Man alive, this game's popping off. Look at this. Hello, everybody. Oh, I need to turn this in. Go away, you stupid ostrich. Ka -ka! I hate him. I hate that bird. Village rebuild. Oh, I needed uh, five. Good thing I've got enough. Uh-huh. Claim reward. That person right there spent money. That's that costume. That Kitsune costume is the equivalent of $40. <laughs> I'm not going to say I'm against the cash shop in this game, but good Lord. It's so expensive. I didn't even level up. Are you kidding me? Look at where's my XP bar. Oh my God. 4497. All right. So help me. I'm getting this off of mobs. I will. I will get this off of mobs, dude. There you go. Eh. What should we call the bird? 
I think we should call him Thompson. Right? That's a good bird name. Or like stupid idiot because nobody likes him. Yeah, you know what? I mean, I'm not even I'm just gonna walk. It's just as fast. Let's face it. I'm kidding. The the aiming, like, it gets the job done, but I would much rather just be a warrior and go in and hit things, dude. Especially with like look how inaccurate the shots can be. Aha! We leveled up! I should not have fought that dog. Hey Matt! Also, hi everyone else. James, good attempt, but no, I'm not naming him that. I'm not even going to repeat that. I don't want to get demonetized. God damn it. <laughs> no, that's okay. We will call him Pecker. Because he's a bird and he's got a beak, okay? Let's actually call him like... We should probably call him like some type of a disease. Oh, no, wait. I didn't know he had cute little gra glasses on. All right, um... We'll call him Dr. Mobius. And he's he's actually a scientist that was transformed into a bird. Uh, but only I can understand him with magic. Right? Yeah. Um. Ah, oh, we got a skill point. Sweet! So we can unlock this to get the tannery. Yes, good. Sweet! Oh my god. Alright, let's go and see if we can end up uh can I craft the tannery now? Yes, I know there is a lot of uh, copper there, Corey. I did go to the desert. Where's Dr. Cornelius? What was his name? I don't... Whatever. Did I complete this stupid idiot's quest too? Hey, dum-dum. Lowest level character 5, highest level 60. Excuse me. Complete village requests. This guy's a weirdo? Like, okay, claim bonus. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> oh, you were telling others. Yeah, sorry, it might take me. I'm, I'm kind of engaged with the game and trying to reach out at the same time, so it's going to be tricky for me to keep up, guys. Just a heads up. Yeah, the game's officially out. You can download it right now. It's absolutely free, and it's cool. I like it. I mean, I already liked it in general. It's got its problems for sure, but oh, good lord. I don't think I'm ever going to get used to turning around and seeing you guys there with those creepy ass smiles. Like, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, Thiege, but <laughs> seriously. Bum, bum. All right. Oh, yeah, here we go. All right, this is going to take like, this is going to take so freaking long to finish, dude. I really am going to hate this. Sort the chest. Do I have, you know what? I can. Yeah. Maybe we'll leave that. Let's see. How does this work? Actually, you know what I didn't even look at? How much did this cost to make? Oh, it's just wood. Oh, thank God. So I can craft like tons of them. Yeah, keep working out, brother. There we go. That's what I like to see. That's what you guys need to do. We need to have like 50 people in my house all doing push-ups and just getting swole. Okay, how does this work? Oh, I'm going to use half of that actually. And then tanning. And of course, it's going to take like 20 million hours. So we will probably get to only experience these at the end of the stream. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> but anyways, uh, on to what I was talking about, like as the warrior. So the staff actually requires us to be level 10 to use it, which means we're not going to get to use it today. But you can see it costs cloth and it costs copper as opposed to the sword, which is still level 10. But I mean, it's just copper. The shield, which, I mean, shields all of those versus this, which is... Uh, my point is that it seems like the warrior is the cheapest class to invest in. Like, I could I could definitely get, like, his full set of gear. And, oh, I almost forgot. Guys. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Sweet! I'm in a skirt! Skirt gang! Skirt gang! Wizards are women only in this game. Also, yeah, I'll accept your friend request, guys, for sure. Boop. Yeah. <clears throat> See, I press escape and nothing happens. Skirt gang. Oh, yeah, here we go, brother. Hold on, where is it? There we go. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah, this is, this is working out good. If I was a little closer, this would look really awkward, but... Hashtag skirt gang. I need to become a warrior, I think. <laughs> as much as I like this guy. Okay. 
Uh, I need the cloth. I've got plenty of copper, but I need the cloth. Can I equip this? No, I can't. Both of those are at level 10. We will be able to make this, though, and then we'll get to at least end up messing with the, um, uh, the different spell with this staff. And then maybe I'll, maybe I'll like wizard a lot more once we end up trying out some of the different magics, right? Uh, where was the other skill? No. Uh, no, no. Where is it? Stop, stupid menu. Also, yes, hello. So that's personal menu, backpack, star shop. No. Where is it? Skills. Uh, battle talents. Oh, there we go. Okay, so, so this is where... One talent, zero XP, huh? Requires one in Grimmar to activate. Okay. Weird. Do I have to have my wand out? Is that why? That's kind of odd. How do you level that up? Interesting. Well, anyways. I thought for sure I would have had a little bit. Um, let's see. What do we want to do next? So, turn in copper ore, a furnace, and copper ingot. Three. Okay. Hmm. I don't know if I don't know if I can spare three. <laughs> you think I can? No, I don't want to discard it. God, I hate the controls in this game, dude. Needs more hotkeys. There we go. Oop. I don't even know what the torn leather is for. Can be crafted into basic armor. Oh, okay. That's just hmm. put those together. Put that in there. I don't even know why I have like a random quest item. Also, hello. Skirt gang, you're kind of scaring me, brother. Uh, where is it? Fuel, that's what I wanted to do, was I just wanted to put that in there. We don't really have any copper or anything. So let's go turn this in. This is, uh, I still got to do the hunter trap quest, which are, do you guys know if the mushrooms are over by the hunter, uh, house? Is that the point? But I'm not sure. Oh my god. Look at this. This is so cool. Why? How do you guys... Like, look at that guy. He's got, like, fully dyed black armor. He looked really cool. Looked like a ninja. Um... Let's see. So, this guy. Which one is this? Uh... Doesn't seem to say who gave me that quest. I'm just gonna assume it's, uh, Ward over here. Right? Yeah, there you go. All right, I got your stuff here, dum dum. Boink. Wow, that gave me like not even a quarter of my total XP. That's amazing. <clears throat> cool. Okay. Uh, giants. Kill the giant things. Okay. Uh, I did see them. Where did I see them? I remember seeing them out in the open world. Dr. Cornelius, where are you? Cornelius! I summon thee. I wish it was like Trove. I wish every game was like Trove, where you would just press the button and get on your mount. Okay, we gotta find mushrooms, boys. We're heading out. Good lord. So slow. Also, someone asked, uh, it says it's a PM saying, how to seed carrot? Well, you go and get carrots just out in the open world. Uh, you can't actually plant them until you've invested into farming, which kind of sucks. It desperately needs an auto walk. Hopefully this game's friendless won't crash your game after some time. Ah, yes. You know what? I'd be happy if it did. Ah. Espresso is my lifeblood. I kind of want that pig. <gasps> Wait, that's not the right one because it's not red, right? Or will he count? Shroomer. Wow. You know what? Suddenly calling this guy Pecker doesn't actually seem as offensive if this guy's called Shroomer, but hey, whatever. <laughs> Anyway, oh god, I forgot they have auto aim. Get lost! Where's the other one? All right, you know what? This will be the test subject. He's level eight for the love of god. Oh, you're easy. You're so easy. You're such an idiot. Die. Good lord. Go back to the devil world from whence you came. <laughs> okay. Getting normal old mushrooms from them. I gotta, I gotta get my, uh... We gotta eat some stuff. My character's getting hungry. 
Um, wait, what? Green staff book maybe lets you start getting talent XP. Not sure. No, I think like uh, I think what you heard was right, Corey. Where eventually you just start getting it while playing, just because it does kind of make sense. Garden giants are shrooms on the ground. Oh. What? That guy was on the ground. What are you talking about? Aha, look! There's an art shroomer. I'm still gonna kill him even though you guys are right and this is not actually the garden giant. Is the garden giant just a plant that I have to harvest? Yeah, it says harvest, okay. Burn. Yeah, that's right. You know what? Die, pig. Just so I can flex my magic spells. Magic missile. When Guardium Livio dead. See, at least being a wizard, we can make all these types of puns, right? So maybe I'll stick as a wizard. <laughs> Otherwise, I don't know what the warrior would... It would just be, Brr, I'm a warrior. <laughs> like, that's the only pun I could make. <laughs> What do you mean in terms of strongest, though, alt? Uh, you mean in terms of damage or just overall balance? Because generally, I've seen that the magic spells seem to be really, really powerful. But of course, the trade-off is I am a glass cannon and super squishy. But I would not be surprised if the bows uh, are the strongest, just because they're almost always the strongest. This is a garden giant? Bruh. I've harvested plenty of those. I've just let them die. Okay, well, now I know. Pure damage archer is the best for that. Okay, uh, how's the, how's the bow? How do you guys find the bow? Is it the same, like, do I just click and it shoots? Or do I gotta charge it the same as the spells? Because if I can just click, maybe that would be fun. We could do that. Just be the shadow hunter from Trove, but in this game instead. Except for the fact that it requires leather, which means you gotta kill like a bazillion creatures, which is kind of gross. Gathering ore is easier. Where's more mushrooms? It's getting foggy. Oh, you do charge the shot? Ah, then I don't really care. If it was just a click, 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 like, you know, different than this, because it's like, I'm not the biggest fan of the wind up punch. You know what I mean? That's kind of why I might go into sword and shield, but we'll see. Yes, the game is out, dude. I already had a video talking about it. Oh my God. I kind of blame YouTube for that, but at the same time, hey, that's a carrot. I should get any carrot that I see along the way. Also, this hunter trap quest. Is this the dude at the hunter's cabin? Because if he is, ew. I'm going to have to travel all the way back. But I'm going to grab all the carrots I can because maybe one day we'll get a mount that's better than Dr. Cornelius. Kind of sucks. Nobody really likes him. Stay away from me. I want the flax. Get lost. And yeah, whatever. <clears throat> oh how to get mount i already talked about it he's asking me in game ah no stay away from me you electric idiot that's a lot of enemies right there like oh my god what is this oh geez that was close i don't want to fall down there okay dr cornelius i oh, there there you are i summon thee god i wish i could change my hotkeys I don't know if this bruiser guy was trying to follow me. No, he wasn't. Okay, it was just a coincidence. Oh, there's our mushrooms. Okay, good. Thank God. You can't see everyone in the world, am I right? Uh, I don't know. Is there uh Yeah, because you can see in the top left we're in line four. So that would probably be server. Get him, dude! You got this, even though you're at one hit. Fine, I'll show you true, true magic. Die. I don't even want the, I don't even want the plants, but whatever. Can we change the, the line or server or whatever? Like, does it actually let us do that? I got you, bruh. I'll save you. Huh. Or my spell won't cast. That's cool too. I, whatever. <laughs> Let's leave him on his own. Where's more mushrooms? 
Do you guys see any more mushrooms? Do these ones count, or is it only the brown ones? Because if it's only the brown ones, that kind of sucks. There is some more right there, though. Garden giant? Nah, that's just mushroom. That's why it tricked me. Because I'd seen them both, and I thought they were both just mushrooms. Okay, there is another one over there, too. So we might actually have enough now. Brr. Magic missile! Wingardium Livio dead. Ow. You hurt me, pig. I got a lot more health now that we're actually got this thing. It's kind of interesting. No idea why this game reminds me of Maple Story 2. I think it I think it's safe to say it reminds everyone of Maple Story 2, frankly. It's the character design. Like it looks very, very similar. Where is it? Garden Giant. Oh, I was getting more than a one by one ratio. Okay. Uh Main quest hunter trap before you leave. Nah, for crying out. Press escape. Come on. Huh. At least there's no fat rolling. Oh my god. You aggroed me, you stupid pig. I'm killing pigs in New World. Now I'm killing pigs in this game too. Burn. Yes. Die. Give me more of that leather because we're definitely going to need it. Actually, I should be going out of my way to fight most of these creatures because yepperoni. Boy, I sure do love my shots completely missing. Oh, he just rolled over. He wants some belly rubs. Okay, here, I'll give him belly rubs. There you go, buddy. The game was actually out a couple days ago, guys. Um, You want to know why? Because... <laughs> Even though it's an English release and we're playing on European servers, technically, they're still on China time because it's a China company and they never want to translate any time zone other than their own. Genshin Impact does that as well, and it sucks. Like, even for the North American servers, they give us China time, and it's like, why? Um, okay, we have a long way to go. Oh, boy. Okay. Dr. Cornelius, I summon thee. Oh god, I forgot he's... <sighs> this, like, riding this mount is literally like vacuuming. Like, it, he's not even a mount. It's like I'm just riding on a vacuum. Like, look at this. It's already out of stamina, too. Oh my god, bruh. Oh my god. Don't forget, by the way, to feed Doctor or he dies. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> Where's his food meter? Oh, it's at 100. You know what? Thanks for letting me know. Because now I know to let him starve. That's actually so stupid. Like, why does this game even have hunger? They just saw Minecraft and they're like, Well, we don't understand what the hunger bar is for, but we're going to add it to our game too. Does it add anything though, boss? No. Actually kind of makes the game a lot worse. But we're going to add it anyway. Go, you stupid bird. Ka -ka! At least he can fly, right? Imagine if they had, like... Well, I know there's dragons in the game and stuff, but imagine if they had them as mounts that you could tame. That would be terrible. If he starves, he is dead in your house and lays there dead forever. You know what? That'll be a lesson to all of the other mounts that I end up taming, that they need to be a lot stronger than this guy. I'm gonna let it happen, dude. Don't worry, I, I'm sure that him starving to death is going to take like three real life days anyways, because that's what happens in this game. Everything takes an absurd amount of time. <laughs> now, can it swim? Nope. In fact, he just died. Skirt gang. Guys, stop looking up my skirt. Okay. I w Why am I sprinting? Okay, I'll take it. The, the characters in this game need some serious cardio. Like, seriously, dude. <sighs> I think you should still breed them even though they are starved. Oh, good. I'm happy about that. So your house is later on a graveyard of mounts. Yes, it will be a graveyard of all the mounts that didn't hold up compared to what I want. Because I need something that's actually faster than walking. And Dr. Cornelius barely is. He's an idiot. I hate him. I hate him so much. He's actually, like, I didn't think that there could be anything worse than the horse that I tamed. But he is. 
I don't know how. Oh, also, have any of you guys ever fallen into these chasms? Because this is my first legit cave I've ever seen. I was going to say, how do you actually get out of the chasms? This is not a chasm, though. This is actually like a proper cave. This is so cool. Oh, God. There's weird rock guys in there. Okay. Well, let's take a cool screenshot. There we go. Oh, you can climb. Oh, right. I can. You can climb out of the holes. I completely forgot you can even climb in this stupid game. <laughs> How? How did I forget? Oh, because the game only taught me it at the beginning of the game. And then I never used it again because I never had to. Die, you rock idiot. Oh, God. Hey. Boo. No, no, no. If he's going to cheat, I'm not even going to fight him. Oh, my good Lord. Look at this. Look at getting out of a cave. Wow. I wish that, like, one thing that I feel all games need to do from now on that are voxel games is, um, you, you don't gotta copy everything Minecraft did, okay? You don't need to have it so that, oh, that's a lot of carrots. I have to grab these because they're so hard to come by. But you don't have to copy the fact that I, as a player, can't go up a one block, but I can in a mount, you know? Like, you should just be able to run up one block each. It's such an old mechanic, but it works in Minecraft. It doesn't work in every game copying Minecraft. You know, there's more carrots over there. Oh my god. I'm sorry, guys. I have to go for them. They're just so uncommon. There's so many. We might actually be able to tame something other than Cornelius today. Oh my good lord. There's carrots everywhere. Maybe carrots are more common in the sunflower fields. So I did notice that the carrots do seem to be more common in flower biomes, period. But this is way more than I've ever seen before in such close proximity. So maybe sunflower biome has the most? Actually, come to think of it, the world's not random. So that means everybody could come to this spot right here on the map. And there's just tons of carrots. So that's good to know. In fact, I'm going to screenshot that part. Get away from me! I'm trying to get carrots, man. I'm trying to eat lunch. Oh, right. I forgot. This thing's like invincible to my magic for some reason. At least I can jump and cast. That's kind of cool. Hmm. If you call that casting. Eh. Die, Slimo. Die. He melted. Those guys are weird. They're really, really weird. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing, dude. The normal, like, when I was farming for carrots... Is that more? Yeah, it is. When I was farming for carrots the first time, I ended up finding they were way more common... Uh, oh, that's berries. Dang it. They were way more common in one of the, like, tall grass areas. It was like purple flowers, right? But the thing is, in stuff like that, you basically just go up and it's like, oh, a shiny thing. And by the time you go up to it, you're like, oh, is this a carrot? Okay, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. As opposed to this area where they just seem to be like out in the open, which is really, really nice. Because there was one over there. There was one over there. I don't know how long things take to respawn, but I kind of wish Cornelius would first just follow me around. But hey, whatever. But yeah, it's like you have to you have to go out of your way for this. The the one thing that I'll <clears throat> excuse me that I'll say about this game is uh, like in terms of feedback, I guess it's a snowball effect. That's what I would say this game does, where it takes a really long time to get going. But once it does, like even in regards to taming and stuff, it's like I'm sitting here screwing around gathering carrots like an idiot eventually you can just plant the carrots and grow them and i think you always get a return on your farming i could be wrong about that because guess what i'm not super involved with the farming but i mean at least you'll end up getting more ratio than this because the point is i've actually got some carrot seeds i just can't plant them because the thing that i genuinely worry about with this game is it's like well it seems like even if you're at the end game, you're still going to have to gather copper the exact same way as someone who's at the beginning of the game. And that's no fun. You want to feel like you've progressed. 
Especially because I, I think it's also because I draw a lot of comparisons between this game and New World. Which I know I shouldn't because New World is literally a game created by a billion dollar company. Um, but it's like New World is just so similar in the fact that you're just constantly gathering things, you know? Oh, the cave does have copper that gives more and goblins guard it. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. So at least they got a little bit of a better game loop than I was expecting. That's the thing. Like, looking at this game, you kind of think it's just going to be some piece of crap knockoff. And then it turns out it's not bad. It's, it's pretty good. I'm enjoying myself with it, even though all I'm doing is just gathering plants. <laughs> I kind of wish that I didn't have to spend as much time doing this, but whatever. That's okay. Any more carrots around? Doesn't seem like it. I really wish I could change my hotkeys, though. Okay. Let's go to the docks. Where is this idiot? Go, Cornelius. Go. Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you, Cornelius. You suck. It's okay. He's also kind of deaf. Uh, where's the dock? Is it down here? Oh, there it is. I love how off-center the map is, by the way. Oh, now that was epic. That was probably the most insane, like, parkour anyone's ever seen. Especially in this game. Give me the copper. Rawr. I mean, I'll say this. At least gathering the resources, it's nice and quick. You know, like, it's just bonk, done. Easy. Carrots? Berries, berries. I don't even know if berries are like super useful. Did I get more apples, by the way? Uh, no, I didn't. Gotta keep your hunger up, dude. The hunger is like <gasps> in this game. That's all I can describe it as because it's like, look at this. Oh, num, num, num. My hunger went up by like five. Gross. Carrot? Aha! I wonder how many we got. The devs said they made it off-center on purpose. Well, that's stupid. <laughs> Why would they do that? Also, I completely forgot I didn't need to walk all this way. It worked out because we got to get carrots along the way. Um, hello? Game? Uh-oh. We got to get carrots along the way, but we could have just fast-traveled. I am now invisible. Um, um, head to the opposite shore. Oh, okay. Well, it worked out, even if it was a bit jank. <laughs> the teleport said TP failed. Really? <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> well, now we know how to go invisible. So if this game ever adds PVP, it's not going to, but I'm just joking. <laughs> This is how we can control the field. Oh my god, there's so many like flowers and stuff around here. Go, bird, go! Ka -ka! The other thing too, uh, again, not to draw too many comparisons between this and uh, New World, but I, I found in New World I was barely fishing. Um, because I mixed New World's fishing up with this game's fishing. And let me tell you, this game, like, I, I didn't know that you could make fishing that bad. Uh, <laughs> it's impressive. <laughs> like, seriously. Okay, let me just get Cornelius here. I'm sorry I'm gathering so many resources, you guys, but that's kind of what this game is. How many carrots did we get, actually? 28. Eh, that's not bad. Might be enough to tame a horse. There doesn't seem to be, like, why I wanted to tame Cornelius in the first place is because I wanted to double check. Like, oh, maybe because, maybe because it's a bird, because it's something that I can potentially die from. Maybe it'll end up, uh, you know, having higher stats. Nope. It's just completely random, which means you can just tame, just be safe and just tame a horse instead. 
Uh, I am pretty sure that you do have to, uh, or not that you have to, um, you can breed animals and like your mounts. So I guess you could end up potentially making one god tier yourself. I don't know. I realize you can't restore vigor in the village. Vigor is basically the resin system in this game where it's uh, a cash shop thing. I don't know why this game has it. I guess just because it's just normal for Chinese games to have it. Funny because I thought the resin system or, you know, the, the, what do they call it in other games? Basically phone games have it. And for some reason, China just thinks that phone games are everything. So even though this is a PC game and doesn't make any sense at all to end up having the vigor system, it's in the game. <laughs> I don't know why. But I don't really care either because you can still kind of play and just grind resources and stuff anyways. So it's like, whatever. I think it's uh, vigor is spent like when you're actually doing dungeons and stuff, right? I think. Ah, it didn't take that long to get here. At least this game's got mounts on like New World. So that's something. All right, where is this guy's hut? Where are you, dumb dumb? I got everything you wanted. There he is. We're probably pretty far back on the main quest just because of the fact that I haven't, uh, because I didn't know he wanted mushrooms. They shouldn't call them garden giants. It should say, get the brown mushrooms. Like, seriously, dude. Barry, I hate you. Vigor is for skinning and harvesting. Wait, really? Wait, where's my vigor then? Uh, vigor. Oh, you're right. We're actually spending it. Okay. <laughs> okay, then that is pretty bad. I mean, I don't care. Frankly speaking, being a content creator, I like not only being a content creator, but also just the fact that I like am usually just busy leaving. Like I hop on the game, I let it craft stuff and then I leave. So it's like doesn't really bother me. However, that is pretty cursed. Oop. Done. Go to the Isles dock and talk to Kubo. Okay. Kind of odd, but whatever. What is this crap? Main quest item. Okay. Dr. Cornelius, I need your services. We're going right back where we started. This is literally like... You, you guys think that I'm crazy for drawing comparisons between this and New World, but it's literally the same game. Just this one uh, looks better. <laughs> I mean, New World looks great, but I do really like the art direction in this game, dude. Genuinely. Oh, hey, audios. Also, hi, everyone else. I'm sorry if I haven't said hello to some of you guys, I'm sure. Either just chilling here, saying hi, or lurking, or whatever. <laughs> 20 seconds in bed gets you one vigor, but you can restore like 50 per day. At least I get 54. It doesn't want to go up more. Interesting. Yeah, because you can buy it, right? But I mean, how long? So here's the thing. How long does it take to take uh, to use up all your vigor? Because if it if we're talking about like hours or something or like, oh, you get to get like 300 copper then frankly speaking that's plenty just because the resource gathering is like bleh. oh you can't buy it anymore okay well you know what good they'll probably end up changing it and just adding in a different system later that's the thing like i'm i'm genuinely confused how they uh like how are they monetizing this game you know, like there's the cosmetics and stuff. And don't get me wrong. Whoops. Don't get me wrong. I'm fine with the cosmetics. It's just they cost so freaking much that I don't want to buy them. <laughs> I mean, I say that, but if there was a samurai armor, you bet your butt I would buy it right away. Like they kind of got a little bit, you know, they got the kimono. And it does look cool, but not cool enough for me, gamer. There we go. Let me actually see. Uh, is it this? No. Where the heck is the crown shop? 
Oh, can I not see it unless I'm... Oh, I can only see it in my... Uh, in my house, I suppose. I can only get 93 copper. Interesting. Yeah, then it's, it's a lot more brutal than I thought it was. Hmm. Can't wait. Uh, I'm waiting for Druid Cosmetics. Ah, yes. I don't like Druid. Frankly speaking, if they had a necromancer in this class, dude, oh my god, like where you would just summon skeletons and like have, you know, green colors and just all poison stuff, that would be so cool. I really want to get to like dungeon grinding with you guys and like actually going out and fighting things, you know? Turn in Kubo's letter to Michael. Turn in Michael's bu bundle to Michael. <laughs> Who? It okay, Michael is back in town, I think. You know what? It's faster to go to the crystal. Right? I think so, anyways. Eh, there we go. I like how your mount can't walk to the left or right, but swimming you can. Yeah, I know. It's, uh, yeah. It is quite annoying that we can only go in a straight line on the mount. It really makes me want to do, um, like, if there was an auto walk in the game. I can help you in dungeons. I can heal. How do you heal, alt? What do you, uh... Where's where in the skill tree do you become a healer? That's dope. Is that is that one of the spells or something like one of the magic staves or I thought you were saying no, you weren't necessarily saying you were an archer. You were just talking about archer being OP. I know that the warrior is more about like tanking and stuff in this game than damage, but which kind of makes me want to play it, but Oh, the hemp tome does it? Oh, okay, cool. Oh, Altus had 110 hours. <laughs> Good lord. You have to craft them like 100 times. Ew. Why? Like, you have to craft them that many times to unlock healing, or? <laughs> oh, a carrot. I have to get it. I have to get it. Don't tell Cornelius. I have to get these carrots so I can get rid of him. What, Cornelius? Oh, he's gone. Okay. See, he didn't get offended. Please let me change my keys. Please, God. I want to be able to press G to pull out my mount or something. I, I hate having to use my second hand. Uh, Cornelius? Stop levitating, bro. March on Twitch. What? I don't get it, but okay. I can show you the skill once you're at home. Okay, cool. Uh, wait, where would that be? In here, right? This is your crit rate? No. Oh, no, because the... Right, so wait, 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 wait. Um, is the tome what gives you the spell? I thought it was the... I thought it was the one that did... Yeah, because this is special skill fireball, right? So I don't know why the tome gets you it. Unless unless later on you get like a right-click ability or something. That's still pretty cool. Okay, Cornelius. Whatever, bruh. Uh, no, I don't want to go back home. I want to... There we go. So those are all the other fast travel points, by the way. And yes, I'm using whatever the currency is in this game because I don't care. Frankly, I forgot that it actually took the currency. Okay, Michael? Michael! Michael! Get it, guys? I'm doing the meme. Press X for Michael. Is Michael this idiot inside the house? Not you, Kenan. Hey, there you are. Hello, stupid. A buddy's request. Man, that's so wholesome. Boop. And boop. Wow. Look how much XP I got. Oh, sorry. I I wasn't falling asleep for one second. Why would you think that? Ward! I think it's probably because I'm so far back on these main quests that they're just giving me garbage XP. Uh, oh, okay. Talk to Mora, Cannon, and Iona. Okay. Yeah, I feel like I was supposed to have grabbed... Oh, jeez. I was supposed to have gotten these a long time ago, dude. There we go. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh no, the NPCs are not easy to find. It took me like an hour to find Michael the first time because the game didn't tell me any clue as to where he was. It didn't say, oh, check the biggest house in the village. He's apparently the mayor. Just chilling there. Aha. I know these quests are like easy enough comparatively. Okay, so we just grabbed a crap ton of side quests, but now they want me to just do... Okay. Uh, harvest flax plants. Uh, sure. I like how... Mm. Kind of, like, I'm just going to say, kind of weird, the vigor system. Because it's like, literally, the game wants me to gather plants to progress. And imagine if I was out of vigor. <laughs> then what? It's like, oh, I guess I got to log out for the day. How much vigor do you regenerate when you're offline? Like... Do I literally just wait until the next day? Because that is basically exactly the same as Genshin. Except in Genshin, you can spend all of your vigor or resin uh, in a matter of 10 minutes. <laughs> so I think that this is uh, a fine comparison. I just wonder how quickly you end up regening it. Because in Genshin, I think you get one every eight minutes. So depends how much vigor you end up getting. <sighs> I am an expert at correct, uh, collecting. Correcting? Yep. You need to climb up a tower and go to a specific corner of the room to find one of the guards. Okay, cool. That sounds fun. You get a home invite from Noah. That is someone from our home, but my friend's menu is already glitched and I can't invite you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that sounds about right. No! I need this. Oh my god, I'm going through so many stone shovels. It's ridiculous. You can one-shot everything in the starting area with a level 2 bow. Ooh, nice. Nice tie. I'm looking forward to one-shotting everything with my level 2 staff, but it's going to take me like 15 more hours before I get the next level. Good lord. So, what's max level in this game? Just out of curiosity, not that I'm ever going to reach it, but... Oh, I need flax. I gotta stop getting distracted by things. Uh... Oh, no, oh, I thought that was a carrot. Do you guys know what max level is? Just out of curiosity. I don't remember how much I had yesterday, but when I logged in today, I had like 40. Oh, okay. So it's slow. That's kind of disgusting. Level 20 is currently max? Okay. I take back almost everything I say about this game being a slow grind then, because that's why. <laughs> the game should be... I, I feel like the game needs to advertise that. Because then it suddenly doesn't feel so bad, you know? Turn in flax flower to cannon. Oh, okay, we're done. Yeah, that's not that's not that bad then, actually. Like, I legit thought max level was going to be like 70 or something. So it was like... Which totally made more sense. I like how I'm seeing more people. I keep seeing this Omicron guy. What up, bruh? I'm not staring at you, Dr. Cornelius is, okay? He's kind of a pervert. Oh, Cornelius, you idiot. Oh, damn, dude. Ooh, bow looking, bow looking. He got the drip just by having the bow. I mean, I got skirt gang, but that kind of looks cooler than having a wand. I might, I might try out, like, I know it's pretty cheap. Actually, yeah. What am I thinking? I can just craft all of the starting gear and just try them. Oh my god. Why did I not think of this earlier? Seriously, dude. I could just craft the bow and craft the sword. Maybe we'll do that next time because I don't know how much more time uh, we have for today, gamers. Okay, flowers for an old friend. Here you go, you weirdo. He wants them for himself. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Claim reward. Oh my god. We're barely halfway to level 9. Kill Shroomer. Okay. Kill Goblin Assassin. What does it mean, normal monsters? Is there elites later or something? What? Go to the entrance of the village chef's home. <laughs> Guys. Who is the village chef? <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm at a loss. <laughs> oh, I should have stuff forging. Okay, we'll we'll do that next time. <laughs> you need to go into his house. Into whose house? Who is the village chef? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Jesus, Alt. What are you doing in my house? Oh, stop showing me up your skirt, okay? Oh my god, the female robes look so much cooler than mine. Oh wait, that's because you got like way higher tiered robes. Oh my god. Wingardium Liviosa. Yikes! I, sorry. <laughs> I'm, I'm weird, as you can tell. Okay, um... That's all forging, which is great. Actually, I should grab these. Oh, there's the healing spell. Ooh. Oh, and then I stand in it? Oh, that's kind of cool. Whoa. Okay. Oh, did you just give me sprint or something? Why am I backpedaling so much faster? Oh, you're faster backpedaling when you don't have your wand out. Oh, interesting. Good lord. Whoa. Void magic. Wait, when do you get two spells? Do I have two spells this whole time by holding right click? No, I do not. Okay. I guess that comes later. That's pretty cool, man. Wait. So, I didn't notice any big crowd control spells on you ults. Is that just because you don't have them equipped? Alright, let's see here. You need to craft different staves for different elements. Oh, okay. That's cool. Put that in there. Start that. And then start this. We'll, we'll start. Okay, there we go. Mage doesn't have AoE spells. Really? Oh, then I misunderstood. On the trailer, I thought that the mage had... I thought I saw like a ice rain, right? Am I wrong about that? I thought that's what it was. Uh, boop, boop. Man alive, this UI is slow. Just saying. Okay, uh, you know what? I need to keep eating. Eventually at level 18, I get one. But so far not... Oh, good lord. Okay, so that's way late game. That sucks. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. What level is this? Level 18? Just to use a two-handed sword? Come on. I want to be able to use the two-handed sword now! <laughs> All right. Well, I could... Okay, I can't use these anyway, so it doesn't really matter, but I could craft a bunch of our stuff. Does it finally let me... It finally lets me repair my stuff. Why is my durability almost broken? I got tagged by an enemy like once, excuse me? Ew! Oh, it costs so much. Why does it cost so much? Why would I ever do that? Zero out of three repairs. Repair uh, success rate. Awaiting an item. Why would I ever do that? It would be cheaper for me to craft another one. Well, I'll do it because the quest wants me to. Current repair will not be counted in repair attempts. Cool. Whatever. Boink. Oh, used tanning rack was a quest. All right, sweet. Still barely got any XP. Oh my god, I got so many more quests now. Yikes. Uh, go to the entrance of the chef's home. Oh, it's just that. Okay, I should have just looked at that picture the entire time. Okay, um... Here, let's see. Oh, I am an idiot. I didn't even realize that I could craft better tools. Oh my god. Is there even a point? There's so much, like, they're so much more expensive than just the ones that I find out in the world. I think the only reason is because certain resources would require them, right? Um, used to dismember hunted game. Ew! It shouldn't say that. <laughs> okay. Oh, right. The starting sword is just that crap. Okay. Well, that requires leather and then that requires a crap ton more. Okay. Never mind. I'm not. Nope. I'm not doing any of that. Yeah. I'll go back to the. Uh... All right. I'll just ignore that. What do you want to trade me, Thij? What? Why are you yelling at me? Oh. Oh, right. Feed. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet. I don't have a collar, though. Wait, maybe I can make a collar. I'll double check. Are we trading? I don't know what's going on. There we go. 
That was kind of weird. Okay, uh, let's actually see. Mount, collar. Okay, that's not bad. Copper, and then the other thing. So we'll try and tame one more mount um, before we call it today, guys. And hopefully we'll find something better than, uh, better than Cornelius. Just saying, okay? Also, the game really wanted me to grab one of these taming stables. But I want to get this as a priority. Okay, what was the quest? Mount Taming. Uh, place Taming Stable in your own domain. Cool. Let's do that. I don't know what this is about, but I'm going to plop it down. Turkey Oddbird. Ah, there. Dr. Cornelius is just chilling now. Okay. Feed tro through? Oh, trough. Okay. No, 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 no. You ain't getting my steed feed. No, no, no. No, thank you. Oh, whoops. I got a craft uh, feed. Actually, you know what? Maybe I don't need to because I can just cheese it and use these and then these and then... Actually, wait. When do my carrots expire? You know what? I may as well just forge them all. Why not? Okay, let's do it. Boink. Sweet. So we'll be able to get another horse from this. Um, so do I have to, do I have to, like, disband this guy, Dr. Cornelius? I really don't like the fact that you don't get your saddle back. That seems stupid. Just saying, okay? Uh, let me put that there, put that there. I should probably, ew, worms. I like how worms don't expire, but it, literally everything else does, like, okay. Kind of annoying, but whatever. Animal fat. Ah, yes. Delicious. Put that there. Put that there. Go away. Oh, I got seeds. Okay. These I can actually plant. Um, uh-huh. Yeah, sorry, guys. One sec. I know you guys keep asking me things in-game, but I'm busy. Can't you see? Would you like to get a tiger next time or a bird? Better than doctor or a better bird? Nah, I don't even know what you're talking about. I'm out of here, man. I'm going to go and tame one more mount before we call it for today, gamers. But this was fun. I like actually being able to hang out with you guys. And now that you guys can actually play, you can give me tips and stuff. Like, it's great. The game's cool. And now that I know max level is 20, it kind of is like, oh. Oh, what the? Gonna... Yeah, I was gonna say she's gonna speak Chinese. Remember this game actually has cutscenes? I don't. Did that was that it? Go to... Iona wants to speak to you. Who the heck? Okay. Iona! Oh my god, look. Look guys, it's Alpha Rad. Or Alpha Dad. I like that. I like him. Iona, you idiot. What quest do you want me to do? Um Oh, that's it. Complete quest. Cool. Head to the top of the watchtower. Oh, that must be the one that you were talking about, Siege. So that is done as well. Oh my god, we're almost, we're halfway up level 9, guys. It's kind of getting there, but also not. Will you make a video of you grinding with Lunar Lancer? Well, I already had one, dude. I already had the stream. Let's someone's fireball that's pretty cool we can give each other smoke signals hi yeah the vfx goes so far okay i gotta find another horse but oh you have no mounts on you okay good so i put cornelius in my house which means that i don't have to disband him and there is our new horse right there i'm gonna try and tame the shadow steed and i swear to god you better actually have good stats, okay? Yes, Jabrias. Does it matter what level the creature is? No, it doesn't, because the bird was literally, like, level 6. Here you go, stupid. Here you go, stupid. Here you go, stupid. Here you go, stupid. Uh, here you go, stupid. When does it say he's happy? Hello? Here you go, dum-dum. There you go. Its mood looks good. Gimme! I swear to God.
He's just as bad as Cornelius! Oh my god! You suck! Why? Why? I just want a better mount. I need, like, movement speed. Hello, Pog Brisket. <laughs> I like that username. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Uh. Oh my lord. Oh, Ty, it's you. Oh, sweet. That pig looks dope. You look like a proper warrior, man. I'm still sitting here in skirt gang, but whatever. Ah, uh, it takes so much resources to end up taming these creatures, dude, but... Oh my god, look how much faster his mount is! I've gotten three mounts now, all of them with F-tier speed. All of them. You know what? You know what? I will release you back into the wild, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry, mount breeding. Oh God, okay, so that's the next step. Well, we'll deal with that another time, guys. Give me, ah, I wanted to steal this horse, dang it. Uh, no, I wasn't gonna steal anything. What are you thinking? Okay, anyways, gamers, uh, I think that's gonna do it for today. Thank you so, so much for coming out. Really appreciate it, guys. Uh, looking forward to streaming this game some more and playing with you guys some more. Hopefully you had fun and hopefully now you understand how to get mounts. Yeah. Have a good one, guys. I'm going to set up and stream some other stuff, but I got to take a quick little break and get myself some coffee and a snack and junk like that. But either way, it's a cool game and it's free. So it's like, why not get it right? Bye, guys.